destination. Enjoy your stay. Ready for departure. Enjoy your stay. You're good to go. Already you move through the citadel as if it were yours. Perhaps someday it will be. I am the apprentice and voice of Darth Charnas. I speak in his name, and I would bargain for your services. If your master needs me, he can come to me himself. My master prefers to remain in the shadows, but do not doubt his power, nor his ability to reward success. I speak for him. I require individuals capable of gaining prestige in a society weaned on secrecy and madness. Individuals who can earn respect, if not love. I need infiltrators to eliminate an enemy of the Sith. You would serve well. I serve no one. I suggest you learn that quickly. I chose my words poorly. I apologize, but you are needed. Our enemy is the Order of Revan. A cult of fools hidden at every stratum of Imperial society. For years, the Revanite heretics have secretly recruited military officers, powerful Sith, wealthy mercenaries, anyone who can add to their power. If they're secret, how do you know anything about them? My master has spent many years learning of the Revanites. Together, we have exposed many. Instead of following the Emperor and his Dark Council, the Revanites follow a long-dead Sith Lord, tainted by Jedi ways. If you can uncover the Revanite leader's identity for us, my master will reveal him to the Dark Council. His destruction would be assured. All you have to do is join the cult. I can get you inside, but you must earn their trust. I will earn more than their trust. 
I will earn their fear. That may be enough. The Revenites have a secret compound in the jungle. Take this token to the cultist at the entrance. He will initiate you. Earn an audience with their leader. When you have seen his face, return here, and you shall have your reward. Ready for departure. Enjoy your stay. Piece of cake. Did you lose your way in the jungle? You have my sympathies, but we can't help. We have no food or water to offer. There's nothing for you here, and strangers are not welcome in this place. You'd best be going. I was given this token. Does it tell you anything? I'm not sure. Ah, you do have the token. Someone must have had great faith in you to send you our way. Welcome to the Order of Revan, Initiate. Welcome to your new life. I'm looking for the Revanite leader. Am I talking to the right man? <laughs> no, I only guide Nissiot along the path. This place is our haven, built by the Master and protected by the faithful. Here we leave our duties to the Empire behind. This is where the Master guides us in the mysteries of Revan, the one who began a Jedi but grew into a Sith, and then something more. There's nothing greater than the Sith, nothing more to achieve. Is that right? The Sith are a path to power, but is the Sith philosophy where that path ends? As a Jedi, Revan was a warrior who slaughtered armies. As a Sith, Revan was a teacher who trained a thousand dark apprentices. Eventually, Jedi and Sith both turned on Revan. But instead of being destroyed, Revan was reborn. If all that's true, why isn't Revan known better? The Empire tries to bury Revan as a minor figure out of fear. Revan was stripped of power, stripped of life, of memory, and left to rot. And still, Revan relearned the ways of the Force. The reborn Revan destroyed Jedi and Sith, and came to Drum and Kaas. Although Revan's life ended here, the Master preserved that life, so that we may learn from it. I don't believe this cult is just about learning. We learn to be better, more powerful. Even though the Empire may not publicly support us, we believe in the Empire's ways. Revan mastered the light side and the dark side, war and peace. We seek to walk the same path. Take part in our rituals, learn Revan's path to greatness, succeed, and you earn the right to join us. Then I look forward to learning. Around you, you'll find your new teachers, Revanites who have spent their lives recovering the works of Darth Revan. Speak to them. Complete the tasks you are given. When you are through, return to me, and the Master will give you your final lessons. among the initiates who wish to join our order, and this is good. But tell me something. You are here because of the Order of Revan. Are you ready to die for us? Are you looking for a fight, old man? No, I'm only asking a question. Consider carefully, for every Revanite must face the trial of death, just as Revan died at the hands of the Jedi and Sith. Death freed Revan, left him unbound from all oaths and promises. It paved his road to rebirth. Will death free you from your past? My past does not bind me. My chains are already broken. Then you have nothing to fear. Before us is a path. Beyond the path is a cave. A cave dedicated to Darth Revan. Initiates fall on the path. Initiates are torn apart by things inside the cave. But initiates who reach the end are reborn. Remade. Tell me more of this. Go. And you'll see, the path is here. The cave. The cave will be more trying. The tougher, the better. Remember, 
Survival is not your goal. Trust in the path of Darth Revan. We have nothing more to discuss. Go and return to me when you reach the end of the cave. Return. Dripping with the blood of the womb, you are reborn. Your old life, everything you were, all of it is dead, buried inside that cave. Of course, whatever you say. You are free now. Free of everything you once were. Savor the moment. It won't come again. Tell me how it feels. Your obligations have vanished. Your past no longer burdens you. How does it feel to see the world reborn? Like I've never killed before. You've done well, and I'm proud that you've begun your new life as a Revenite. Choosing allegiance to us, first of all. Take this gift to guide you in your new life. It will remind you of what you've become. Leave now, and may the Force make you strong. Come forward, speak to me. We're all students of Darth Revan, and I enjoy the company of initiates. I remember when I was like you. I remember my trials and the joy of killing in the Master's name. You're so fortunate. I don't need a cult leader to tell me when or whom to kill. Neither did I, but you'll find that killing as a Revanite is more fulfilling. I'm Ladra, once the personal assassin of a Sith Lord. I am now the serene protector of the Master and his students. I contemplate Revan's teachings as I execute intruders and heretics. But I also guide initiates and help determine their trials. How did a disturbed woman like you acquire so much power? Disturbed? I am the product of Darth Revan's teachings and the Master's instruction. My mind is clear, as yours will soon be. Every Revanite's initiation includes a trial of the past, a right to bind the initiate to Revan. Your right will be very special. You will find the mask of Darth Revan, what he wore after becoming Sith. It's a powerful symbol of his greatness, long lost to us. I have to do this to meet the Master. Of course. The Master doesn't waste time with students. You must complete your initiation. The mask is in a collection of antiquities possessed by my former teacher, the Sith Lord Grathen. It must be freed from that heretic. Rescued in a reign of blood and death. I can't wait to start killing. Speak to Torun, our curator. He'll give you the spiritual guidance you need and tell you where the mask is. When your journey's done, bring the mask to me. Good luck.
welcome the peace that comes with serving the master. What have we got here? I wasn't expecting a visit from any initiates, but you're welcome to stay and talk in any case. I'm Tarun, devoted servant of the master and student of Revan. What can I do for you? I need to know where Darth Revan's mask is, and be quick. So, Ladra sent you. She wants me to ritually prepare you for contact with Revan's mask, eh? A pointless ceremony. Ladra's devoted to the Revanites. She is also obsessed with that mask. Says it talks to her. Ladra wants the mask to represent everything Revan ever was, but he wasn't just Sith. Before his rebirth, he was both Sith and Jedi. I could tell from talking to Ladra that she's lost her mind. I'm glad you noticed. There is a fine line between worship and mindless obsession. It's tempting to seek answers in material objects. Ladra will use the mask to teach that Revan was a being of only darkness. I don't want that mask becoming our Order's sole focus. Bring it to me. I'll keep it safe among a few like-minded scholars. Sounds like you'll benefit from this as well. I'm not after the mask for myself. I have no use for it, except for what it represents. I'm sure Ladra promised a grand reward for the mask. I can't match it, but I can promise your initiation will proceed smoothly. Will you help me preserve the real Revan? Or will you let Ladra overshadow everything with a Sith relic? I'll bet that mask would look good on me. I doubt it's in any condition to wear. Still, that would be better than giving it to Ladra. I don't have to tell you to be careful, but may the Force be with you. May it keep you strong and guide your return. Vehicle pads are currently open for business. Hold your position, please, and keep your weapon holstered. The remotes are scanning you now. You check out. Sorry, my lord. We're on the lookout for anyone with Lord Grathen, and I'm sick of letting him stomp on my people. My lightsaber is the only authorization I need to pass. With respect, being Sith doesn't get you a pass here. Not when it's one of your own. Who's the problem? Look, stick around a minute. I don't know if you're familiar with the situation, but Grathen's a nightmare. The Sith Lord's gone rogue. He's holed up in his estate, past the wall. He's got weapons, shields, and a cadre of scientists developing new tech to use against us. Grathen wants respect and authority from the Dark Council, so in true Sith fashion, he turned on his masters to prove his power. As a result, we have to put up with this lunacy. So if you're here to cause Grathen problems anyway, you might help us out. You have weapons and training. Handle things yourself. Believe me, I'd like to, but my hands are tied. Here's the story. There are nearly a hundred men assigned to this sector, some on the wall, some watching Grathen. Twenty are missing. My men. Practically my kids. Grathen stole them, and I want them back. If your men can't protect themselves, why should I help? Plastic, we're talking about Imperial soldiers. I don't know what Lord Grathen wants with them. Maybe he's holding them hostage just to demoralize us. Who knows? But if you're heading to Grathen's grounds, help them get out. Tell them to report back to their Duchess. That's, um, what they call me. Duchess? You'll have to explain that. You try making it as an officer without getting tagged with a nickname. I've got reports saying that Grathen's been transporting prisoners to another wing of his estate. I don't know if it's my people he's moving, but it's worth checking out. Watch yourself. Grathen doesn't mess around. Thing 
not afraid of heights. Or invading a hostile Sith compound, for that matter. Shh. Can't be seen. Can't be heard. Sensitive business, this. Dangerous man. Authorization. Authorization. System cannot identify. Please don't go. Please don't go. What's happening? Are you with Lord Clathen? Are you invading? System cannot identify. You're awfully emotional for a heap of machinery. You don't. I am not a machine. I'm not a droid. I. System cannot stop. Reassigning priorities. Operating number 2188. It's 97. Please. Did the Duchess send you? Please help me! Your commander sent me to free you, and the others. We failed. Failed to defend ourselves. Grathen's people took us prisoner for experiments. The scientists cut open our heads, put us in droids. Identification model OHK-99. They program us for advanced intelligence. Enhanced combat tactics. Now my body's lying dead across the room. I can see it. 
This mad science is nothing next to the Force. Then destroy it. Destroy this technology. I'm the last. The others have all been converted. They can't talk, can't disobey. But I know they can still think, feel. Please, listen. You can disable us all. Send the shutdown command from our central command console. Please. You can put an end to this. Use the command console. I can't go with you, motor and combat systems non-functional. Please, make it stop hurting.